Hello everyone, today I'm going to talk about my project which is convert from image to a string number. So let's start. So this is my coding. So as you guys can see here, I import cv2 here. This function is uh, recognition, whatever you recognize your face, whatever, whatever you recognize your couplet we must use in this function and also I import num bsmp and os and few function here I import to this program so this is the module level variables so I need to do a few function here so show steps here which means uh, if let's say you type it through the system will appear a lot of image just step by step images the system will show if let's say you put it false the system will only show the important part which means only three images the system will show to you so I will try uh, I will do it a letter so this part is my uh, insert my image here which is from my document so here is all the coding to convert image so here from here to here is my connection to my database so after the finish the execution the system will automatically save it into my database automatically so here is all the detection on the image the width the height uh, all that so let's start to execute it so I execute as you guys can see here so the number here is WMU9324 so after finish execution the system will appear your output here WMU9324 so after the execution finish the data was sent into here list split string charts so which means it will automatically save it into your database so let's check whether the data is executed or not so first of all I empty my database first so as you guys can see here empty so I just run it again I just end the process and I go here and double click check again you can see here Jordan WMU9324 so the bad things is here we need to type it manually about the driver's name or whatever you want to put it the name as a name if let's say I put it as Daryl then I save and run again and I end the process and I check again here you can see here Daryl 9 uh, WMU9324 the system will save it automatically inside into my PHP my admin locals so if I say I want to check whether my data is exist inside my database or not so I can type the tablet number WMU9324 so uh, if let's say I just empty my image if let's say which means the data is not inside my database or the person uh, won't register yet if let's say I check uh, go to my uh, PHP but, uh, just open my HD documents here and here I just type if let's say I type this number and I go to my localhost if let's say I run there's nothing appear inside my website because the data is not accessed inside my data so if let's say I run the program WMU9324 I end the program I go to my database I refresh 
it appear inside my database and I go to my locals and I refresh again yes you can see here the data is appear inside my image which means the data is exist inside my database so you can try yourself with any kind of image but the things I need to tell you is uh, about the background oh sorry about the background wait uh, this one so this one is the original image the background is black color and the font is white color I need to convert it into background white color and the font is black color then only my uh, coding can access this kind of image to execute so the detection is on the black color so if let's say you using this image the system will assume the phone because the phone is white color right so the system will assume the white color is the background so the output will be terrible so we must using this uh, hold on. so you can try any image you want so the most uh, popular suggestion I give you is uh, you can choose the JVJ image uh, which is uh, apply for JVJ so this one is JVJ image which is legal inside uh, not in, which is legal in Malaysia so here is JVJ uh, the legal image so the best image you take uh, is JPJ one, so it will be more, uh, more. The percentage your success will be more la. So whatever image you choose, you can just uh, it put inside here to execute. So that's all about my uh, presentation. So. Thank you for watching my videos, so thank you.